What do magic mushrooms do to your brain? Magic mushrooms, or shrooms, have been used to achieve oneness with the universe and to mingle with rainbow-striped elephants for over 9,000 years. But scientists are only just starting to figure out exactly how these funky fungi work. Magic mushrooms are non-addictive and non-toxic hallucinogens. They contain a chemical called psilocybin. When you take shrooms, your body breaks it down into a different chemical, psilocin, and that's when things start to get a little weird. The psilocin makes its way up to your brain, where it starts binding to serotonin receptors. This causes increased stimulation in your brain and leads to the experience of hallucinations. These can be anything from auditory illusions to visual images, and it often causes time to appear to slow down. Taking shrooms has been found to increase activity in regions of the brain associated with dreaming, memory, and emotions. Contrarily, highly connected areas of the brain actually experience a decrease in activity, which means a lot of neural signals get transmitted via unconventional pathways, the scenic routes of your brain, so to speak. The brain has also been shown to temporarily create completely new neural pathways, which could be what causes someone on shrooms to experience a very different sense of self and to start thinking in profound ways. Even after the hallucinations have subsided, the effect shrooms have on an individual could last far longer. But the effects of magic mushrooms aren't always positive. Sometimes people can have bad trips, characterized by paranoia, fear, and panic. However, researchers have suggested that the chemical in shrooms could potentially be used as a treatment for depression, particularly in people who are unresponsive to typical approaches. Fortunately, there have been several large clinical trials over the last few years, and we're starting to discover some of the tricks these mushrooms are hiding up their stalks. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and drop us a comment letting us know what you'd like us to cover in an upcoming video.